it's actually pretty unbelievable what comes out of your skin. Am I just a super congested person? I don't really think I can get much out of my nose. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hello if you're new here, my name is Casia and I create skincare content to do with my adult acne, my post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation, dry skin, oily skin, and everything in between. So if that sounds like your thing, please subscribe down below to see more content from me. I post every week. So today we're gonna do a full 30 minutes of oil cleansing. I have coconut oil in my hair currently, so I'm just giving it a bit of a treatment and I'm now going to do the skin. So I was wearing makeup today, but I've removed that with some Garnier Micellar Water. So the idea behind this long oil cleanse is to really get into the skin, give it a chance to loosen up and release some sebaceous filaments and other congestion that is within the skin. I have done this before and I also have a video on that that also shows the real results. And I'll be doing it again. I don't know if the amount that's going to come out of my skin is the same, but we will see, we will see the results basically. I don't know what's gonna happen and I can only hope that it's gonna help my skin feel refreshed. I'm gonna use an oil cleanser specifically designed to cleanse your skin. I'm using True Skin Care, which I've recently discovered. And this is a certified organic clarifying safflower and geranium cleansing oil with vitamin E, oily to normal skin. This cleansing method is definitely not needed every single day. I just like it as a treatment. It does do things to my skin and my skin always feels nice afterwards. The massage, a bit of lymphatic drainage also helps with the skin complexion. Don't be afraid of oils if you are acne prone. So to start with, I'm gonna wash my hands and then start applying the oil. So it is literally 9.30. We're gonna start right now. So I've got a tissue here where I'm hoping to grab whatever I've managed to pull out of my skin and put it there. This is also referred to as oil pulling and we want to get out those oil plugs. I'm really going to take my time with this. There's no need for me to rush. There's no need for me to be rough with my skin. I'm just gently going to start in circular motion around my skin. It's funny because I always feel the most on my sort of cheekbones, but I get the most breakouts on my lower face. So, I mean, I don't know what that means to be honest. <laughs> I can already feel things coming off my skin and I feel like some of this is probably the dry, dry skin that I have going on. I like to do this rolling motion. I'm of course not a professional. I do things gently, I do things that feel good and I feel like this helps as well. This is gonna be kind of like a pamper routine for me because I'm gonna do this oil cleanse and then I'm gonna sort of get rid of any oil residue with a foaming cleanser, just do a light one. I don't wanna dry out the skin or anything. Just because this isn't a cleansing oil that emulsifies, meaning when I apply water, there's still gonna be an oily residue. And then I think I'm gonna do a clay mask as well, just because I fancy it and being a bit bougie. I'm not being rough with my skin by any means, but I do feel like I'll probably end up with a bit of redness after about 30 minutes. Maybe more just of a flush where I've, you know, brought some blood to the skin surface. Totally understand that not everybody has 30 minutes to do this kind of massage, but if you can get a bit of time in and make your cleanse a little bit longer every now and then, and just enjoy the process, put on some music, watch a YouTube video of mine, that should be really relaxing, it doesn't have to be a chore. So we're already getting some things out of our skin and it's only been seven minutes. I can definitely feel a lot more on the surface of the skin.
So it is now approaching 10 p.m. But I am just gonna keep going a little bit because I know I've taken some time to put, you know, get some shots of the things that are coming out of my skin, pop them on the tissue. Now, I feel like some of this is definitely dry skin because they're just so big, they're big clumps. But some of it, I do see little black dots, which I believe to be sebaceous filaments, possibly some blackheads coming out. There's only so much that I can get onto the tissue or get onto my hands, but I'm, I'm trying to show you as much as I possibly can. So far enough, I've actually kind of been feeling quite a few bits like around here, just under my earlobe. Uh, I don't tend to get like breakouts there, but I can definitely feel some lumps. From what I see coming off my hand, it looks like dry skin. And perhaps this is an area that I tend to neglect a little when I am cleansing. If you wanted to incorporate lymphatic drainage, you could really do some movements, taking them to your temples. They can be very, very slow. Move it down to your neck, but I'm really just gonna keep rolling. I am putting a little bit of pressure to try and create, I guess, a vacuum. So I wanted to try and keep this video as real time as possible so you guys know that this was fully coming. You know, I'm not here to scam anyone. These are the things that are coming out on my skin. One thing I will say is if you're gonna do this, I don't know if it'll be the same if you just simply, you know, sort of do this and this. You wanna do tiny circular motions it's actually pretty unbelievable what comes out of your skin. Am I just a super congested person? Okay, we are 33 minutes down. It went very, very quickly. Like I said, I brought a bit of redness, some blood to the surface of the skin. Let's show you the tissue. Obviously the brown bit is oil, but there are some, for me, the smaller ones are definitely sort of more blackheads, oil plugs, but the big ones I still feel, is it dry skin? So I'm now going to do a nice cleanse to get this oil residue off because I did use a generous amount and then I'm going to do a clay mask. minute oil cleanse has completed. I've got in there, done my thing, cleansed thoroughly, applied a clay mask to now purify the skin, bring out any more impurities to the surface and I'm going to wash this off in a bit. Thank you so much for watching guys. Please subscribe if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. I upload every single week so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!